welcome to another vlog. Today is one of those rare days where my mom is joining. We are having a day in Manhattan and we are starting with some coffee and culture because there's a new cafe from the UK that opened up one street over from the MoMA. So we figured we'd combine the two. Then we're gonna head to Tiffany's because mom hasn't seen the new location and it's really pretty. And then we are going to explore from there. So come along, join us. We are gonna have a fabulous day. The weather is supposed to be 70 degrees. So in March, what more can you ask for? sweatshirts and totes but went in New York so now we are the proud owners of a set of MoMA sweatshirts in our signature colors of black and blue and we are headed to Tiffany's Good next market. it has gotten very busy on Fifth Avenue when we first came over here it was still the morning and now it is 1 p.m. and the crowds are out which is kind of enjoyable on a day like this
lovely time inside Tiffany's. It turns out there is an art exhibit, complimentary, but you have to register online for tickets on the 8th and 9th floor. So you just take the elevator all the way up to the 9th floor. They have a Basquiat. They have a whole range of artists that are also represented on each of their floors because Tiffany was an avid art collector. So it's kind of woven throughout. Really nice. The staff was amazing because they explained all of this to us. That's the plaza, by the way, we're walking by because now we are headed to actually meet my sister. She's in town and we are going to go to a cafe and enjoy one hour together before each of us has to go off and do separate things. So the subway is right on Central Park, so we do get a little snippet of the park on our way out there. because tomorrow is the day that Joelle is in town, my sister, not today. So we, it was just the two of us. It was delicious anyway. Now my mom is headed back to our house to babysit Luca and I am headed to a networking event and Jackson is as well. So she has kindly agreed to watch him for us. And I think they might head to the park. So I hope that you guys enjoyed spending the day with us, the afternoon with us and I will see you guys later. All right, I just got to Columbus Circle after saying goodbye to my mom because the networking event that I'm going to is here. It's a female founders pitch competition and two of my friends are in it. I'm going to quickly nip into Nordstrom because we have been on the hunt for my mom's eyebrow pencil all day no one is stalking Bobby Brown. So let's see if this is the one. Sold out. This Bobby Brown eye pencil has been the hardest thing to get a hold of. What the heck? I'm gonna keep trying because it's my mom's product that she likes to use, but I might have to end up ordering it for her. I did walk out with some new Clarence products because I'm out of serum and they sold me on the eye serum too, which is like a combo, so I don't need eye cream. I actually bought another eye cream today, but I might return it and just try this new one. Now I'm headed into the vent. Good morning! It's a new day and I am now actually off to meet my sister. This time she is in town. I have confirmed. And my mom left with Luca this morning. As I said before, he is spending a weekend with his grandparents. And honestly, it's been a rough morning. It took us an hour and a half to get out the door because of tantrums. I love my mom so much. I appreciate her so much more now that I'm a parent and it's kind of crazy how much you still need your parents when you're a parent. Just wanted to leave that there. And now I'm going to meet Joelle, my sister. 
headed to Soho. I don't know if I said that because she wants to take a look in a store and we're gonna grab some lunch. So it should be a good Friday afternoon. stopped by Sorate for a matcha, an iced matcha, and it is so good. I highly recommend if you're in Soho and it's one of your favorite drinks to go check them out. They have a variety of matchas to choose from and it is delicious. I have no notes. So good. <laughs> afternoon shopping in Ghani and then going and basically having a couple of glasses of wine at a cafe as one does on a Friday afternoon uh, now I'm headed home so I will see you guys there just waking up having my coffee and before I sign this vlog off I wanted to show you a few things packages that have arrived today we are back on the Cezanne hauls which is really exciting and then I also have another package and a couple of things that I picked up with my mom in the city and I couldn't be more excited because I'm basically starting to shop for spring and summer I am over this April showers weather and it's not even April. So we are just gonna ignore the fact that the weather isn't quite there yet and start to get excited about the warmer days. We had a really nice, weirdly nice week this week. As you saw, we had basically almost 70 degrees and I'm here for it. So this is my mindset. I'm thinking about warmer days. So let's go take a look at what I got. 
So this is everything that I got and we are going to open it together. Before we get into the big stuff, I picked up the Clarins Double Serum for face and eyes. I really desperately needed hydration for my skin and I always use Clarins Daily Moisturizer, so I thought I would give these a try. They have come highly recommended from a variety of people and so far I've been loving them. Next up, cause. I picked up this beautiful leather bag that I saw on Instagram and I just couldn't resist. It has a really long strap and it just looks so slouchy, comfy, cozy, and cute. So I'm planning on using this instead of a tote because I think I'm going to be able to fit my tripod in here. And finally, Cezanne very kindly gifted me these two pieces. First up, their basket bags are back which means it's this beautiful basket bag. They're back in stock and they have a variety of different styles and I just couldn't resist this beautiful texture when it comes to a spring summer purse. It's also big enough to chuck in all of my stuff so I don't have to take two bags around the city with me when I need to step out. And it does come with a sewn in pouch. So if you're a city girl like me, you don't have to worry about things being out in the open. You can close it up and hide them away. The other thing I picked up is a pair of shoes and sandals to be exact. I love a good pair of dad sandals and I don't have any slides. I've been eyeing the Chanel version of these black ones but can't justify the price tag. So Cezanne makes this beautiful leather pair and they fit so nicely. You can also tighten the strap so that you can make it more securely on your foot. And I can't wait to wear these in summer. Okay, so I quickly wanted to show you how I plan on maybe styling this purse. I just plan on wearing it with like a nice blazer, a casual jean, and I feel like this will go with a lot of different things. And it's just like so funky, which I love. It does also come with a zipper and because it is so nice and long I'm pretty sure I'm going to be able to actually fit my tripod as planned. And for the Cezanne bag, a couple of things that I want to point out is one, it comes with these long straps so if you do want to carry it over your shoulder like this you can. You just kind of tuck in the other ones. It's a really good size. I think they also do a maxi if you need a beach tote, they do a mini if you want more of a going out bag, but I really like this medium size. Or you can carry it over your arm like this, you just tuck in the other ones you don't need, and it's really cute. So basically what I'm saying is I'm very ready for spring to start and stay. This is what the shoes look like, so I'm not going to put my toes out there right now because they are not camera ready but they do fit so well and i am very excited to start wearing them so that is everything i wanted to show you i hope that you enjoyed my day in the city with my mom and then soho with my sister and this little haul let me know which one was your favorite below i will of course leave all the links and i will see you in my next one bye